In this documentary, we are going to be talking about a very elusive creature, the Moto Vlogger. What is a Moto Vlogger? Or content creator? It is a very strange person that likes to talk to a camera, likes to talk to people about his motorcycle, likes to talk about picking up the mail. And who sent him the mail? The Motovlogger is a very strange creature, mostly found in his driveway, possibly in his workshop during the winter time, or garage. This strange creature will go to different events and try to talk about it, try to take you there. In this documentary, we shall be examining the strange world of motovlogging in their weekly struggle to create and produce videos. Come along with me and explore this strange world as we examine the motovlogger. The Moto Vlogger considers himself somewhat of an expert and will often try to show instructional videos showing all of the things that could be done on a motorcycle and sometimes even giving in-depth tutorials to help you learn how to use your motorcycle or add parts to your motorcycle effectively. I'm not going to look right on top of that. I don't want to look through that at all. And uh, when you put a passenger on back here, it's going to go down and this windshield's going to come up. That's just all this to us. You don't want to, just these shocks, your suspension, you know, get, get that back up and that down. I'm not going to change mine because I'm not where it's at. What's wrong with you people? Were you born in an outhouse or something? When the doors open to the elevator, step back and wait. There's a good chance there's people on the other side. Sometimes, the moto blogger will have in depth knowledge on how to repair things or how to operate things. End up with a decent looking seat. Now, go stick it on your bike and continue with the next phase of restoration. Or better yet, Start her up and go for a ride on the damn thing. Some moto vloggers are just really nice guys, and they like to show you things and do it in a very, very polite way. Other vloggers like to share information and talk about various subjects as they ride along. This can be quite interesting, and it is something that is a bit odd about the motovlogger, they have this need to talk while they ride. There are very many of them that do this. Other vloggers have fantastic workshops with beautiful motorcycles. And it's just something to just wonder and look at all of the fine, shiny bits that they have on their bikes. Ah. Oh. Just a joy to watch. There is another phenomenon that happens in the moto vlogging world. This is the live stream. There are moto vloggers that will do weekly live streams and they will talk about all types of topics around motorcycle and motorcycle riding. There is yet another type of moto vlogger that enjoys showing us his travels and their vacations and the type of places that they like to go. I find these moto vloggers very, very interesting. And they always have a very fantastic grip on photography and editing.
I think what I enjoy the most about the moto vloggers that take us on trips is taking us to places we've never been before and seeing things that we haven't seen before. And I really appreciate being taken along. But I think I, what I like most is when a YouTuber will make fun of a situation and just have a little fun to entertain us all. And when we have things that are serious but we make fun of them, I think YouTube is at its best. So just enjoy these last few clips of YouTubers having fun at their own expense. If you liked that video, hit the subscribe button. If you didn't like that video, hit the subscribe button. Please like, and I'll catch you on the next one. <laughs>